the melancholy of a last run darkened the glory of a warm, bright Appalachian morning. As the tiny Baldwin ten-wheeler retraced the route traveled so many times before, she was turning the last page in the history of narrow-gauge railroading in the Blue Ridge. Let's go back to the final years of the East Tennessee and Western North Carolina Railroad. ride the rear platform of the caboose as the train travels the dual gauge iron from Johnson City to Elizabethton. Levens, the engine works hard upgrade. wend our way through the beautiful Blue Ridge scenery and route to Cranberry.
This time in 1949, there was little work at Cranberry. There was little work at all left for the narrow gauge. In another year, the last one would be made. There are more than memories left, however. The quaint little narrow gauge still lives in the hearts of many who never witnessed her in action. A true national treasure, locomotive number 12 continues to operate on the Tweetsie Railroad in Blowing Rock, North Carolina. Freight is still hauled by the East Tennessee Railroad on the last eight miles between Johnson City and Elizabethton.